Have you ever wondered, where do we get all the air to blow into a balloon? Or where does the air go when we breathe in? We're going to find out in this STEM at home video, model the respiratory system. The respiratory system has four main parts, the chest, the windpipe, the lungs, and the diaphragm. The chest protects the lungs. The windpipe is like a pipe for air from our mouth and nose to the lungs. The lungs let the body get oxygen and get rid of carbon dioxide. The diaphragm is a muscle in the belly that helps with breathing. When we breathe in, the diaphragm goes down, the lungs get bigger and let air with oxygen in. When we breathe out, the diaphragm goes up, the lungs get smaller and pushes air with carbon dioxide out. To better understand how we breathe, let's model a respiratory system. We'll need these materials. Two straws. Transparent tape. Three balloons. Scissors. And one empty transparent bottle made of hard plastic with cap. Step 1. Cut off the bottom half of the bottle. If the plastic's too hard, ask an adult for help. Step 2. Screw a small hole on the cap. Make sure the hole is just big enough for the straw to get through. We will need the cap to be airtight. Step 3. Cut and tape the straws to make the windpipe. Get two straws. Cut one in half, creating two short straws. Fold the tip of the short straws in half. Insert the two short straws with folded tips into the normal straw to create the windpipe. Step 4. Make the lungs with two balloons. Tape two balloons into the two openings of the windpipe. Make sure no air gets out. After taping the lung into the windpipe, try breathing to the windpipe through the long straw to see if the balloons can get bigger and smaller evenly. Fold the tip of the straw and push through the hole on the bottle cap. Close the cap. Step 5. Get the other balloon and cut off the neck. Then use your hands to stretch the balloon over the wide opening of the bottle. Pull the middle of the balloon down to see if the balloon sticks to the bottle. If the opening of the bottle is dented, that means that the plastic is too thin and weak. Find another one with thicker, hotter plastic. When we breathe in, the diaphragm goes down, the lungs get bigger and let air with oxygen in. When we breathe out, the diaphragm goes up, the lungs get smaller and pushes air with carbon dioxide down. Right now, the COVID-19 virus attacks our respiratory systems and our lungs. That's why during the pandemic, we have to protect our respiratory system with the 5K rules. Face mask, distancing, disinfection, no gathering, and health declarations. Well, that's it guys. We finished the respiratory model and its parts. The chest, the lungs, the windpipe, and the diaphragm. Please share this activity and knowledge to your families and friends. Stay home and stay safe. See you in the next STEM at Home video.